We're hiking Arethusa Trail for large season. And I am that crazy person right now wearing no toque, tank top, shorts. Everyone else is like pretty bundled up. Um, and it's kind of snowing a little bit, like slushy snow. But it's hot. Do you think large season hiking is too crowded so you've been avoiding it? Well, we feared that too. And I can happily tell you that we slipped in at noon right when spots were opening up because hikers were still coming in and out. So with a little bit of patience, you can find a good parking spot. So don't let that busy buzz keep you away from this beautiful scenery. Arethusa Trail is a loop presenting a choice, left or right. We ventured left, challenging the trail steeper in breaks. Yes, it was more challenging to climb than going right, but I recommend this path for the thought of descending it. If you have little kids or even small dogs, I would highly recommend going up this steeper hill because it will be very challenging going down. Once we arrived at the top, I was quickly cooling down, the snow beginning to fall. We stopped for a quick snack and the view was just absolutely gorgeous. My hands and body were freezing though, so we decided to continue on. Tank top Jody is gone. Once we got to the top, it was freezing. And now my hands are gonna fall off. <laughs> Izzy's all worked up because she saw some chipmunks. She's just loving this hike. Me on the other hand, I wish I had mittens. The trail going down was perfect. My knees were not feeling too weak and my toes were not hurting being pushed up against my shoes as they always do when coming down after a hike. I 100% can recommend this easy hike to anyone with dogs or kids, but bring layers because you never know. Is there a large hike that you recommend? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe.